You took yeah. penis pills. I took a penis pill. Why take these pills? I really just wanted to see what it'd be like to get a chemical boner. Just kind of wanted to put a little extra something in there, you know. I buy this one that has a big gorilla picture on it. Do you know that gorillas actually have penises that are this small? Um, you just thought these pills would make your penis one of those like inflatable things outside a car dealership and just like make people come to your boner like. I forget what kind they were, but um... Would you remember if you heard it? Probably so. Okay, was it semen strong? No. Max load? No. Bone sweet bone? No, it wasn't bone sweet bone. Was it jizz cannon overspew Y2K? Flaunty python? Was it Dicole Sun? No, I don't... Won't you come? Me? Come? Walsh away. Planet Girth? What about... Ooh, you nasty. Boy, yoing, yoing, yoing. Colossal. Jerk do so laid? Ween Bay Packers? Dick Van Dyke? Was it executive produced by Dick Wolf? I don't think so. Walker, Texas Dangler? No. Was it Knock Knock? Who's there? No, no, it wasn't. And you're not, I'm not done. It's a long name. Oh, was it Jizz based on the novel Balls by Sapphire? Was it Oomph? Was it- Hey ladies, how are ya? Uh, no. Okay. Do you know what's in these pills? No. Do you care? You don't know what's in those pills. Oh yeah, true that. I do remember one chemical, it was, um, did you even look at like what was inside these pills? I, you know I didn't, you know? Yeah, that makes sense. Why not go get a prescription for something that is actually re regulated? Seems like a lot of effort. Get Obamacare. Will he give me erections? Go see a real doctor. Okay, Dr. Drew, in your professional opinion, what do you think of these gas station dick pills? At best, a waste of time. At worst, dangerous. Do you know what, what exactly is in these pills? There, there's, a, there's a lot of stuff. You know, there's something we used to use back in the day when I was first practicing called Yohimbi. Isn't that the name of the gorilla that they shot? What kind of dangers? It's like any other supplement. The problem being, though, you don't know when you're going to get some adulterating agent in there that could harm you. In which case, you can really get serious complications. You can get something called priapism. Which is? Which is a sustained, painful erection that does not go away. Okay. You can need a surgery where they literally have to splay the penis to relieve the pressure. Whenever I want to get young men to do anything, I just tell them it's going to affect their schwanz. Yeah. What about you, though, Dr. Drew? When yeah. you were young and dumb and full of questions, yeah. did you ever say, hey, I'm going to I'm gonna do something like this. I'm going to try this. <laughs> We're really going to get into this. Uh, first of all, had there been such a pill around, I probably would have taken it. Yeah? Yeah. I probably I, I was young and dumb, for sure. Besides the splayed penis priapism surgery, what is the worst thing that, that could happen for them? Worst case, you could wind up dead. With a great dick. Mm. This message brought to you by Los Angeles Independent Medical Providers. <sighs> We've all been there. You're at the checkout counter at your gas station, 7-Eleven, wherever you buy your shiny hot dogs. And they're greeting you as a rack of mystery dick pills. They have names like Rock Hard Weekend. And you're like, all weekend? Like, I have my sister's graduation party. I don't want to be hard for that. Your dick is not a rhino. If you're a young dude with a limp dong, you probably have intimacy issues. Go talk to somebody. I'll talk to you about your penis. No. I mean like a doctor. I was a doctor in my home country. No! A pill can't fix a broken dicks. Because I think I speak for everyone when I say I'd rather deal with a limp dick than a dead person. Well. Say no to gas station dick pills. It's my proudest moment. Right here. This is it. This is Nikki Glazer, and this is the part of the video where I tell you to watch more of my videos, but I'm not gonna tell you what to do. Instead, I'm just gonna look at you judgingly.